Hi guys, welcome to my video. Today we are going to work a little bit on Apache 2 web server and I'm going to show you how to configure a new virtual host using SSL through HTTPS protocol to accept connections for a fully qualified domain name. I'll be using a virtual machine and my host operating system for this experiment. But before we start, let me remind you, you can subscribe to my channel and click the bell button so you can receive notifications about all the videos I'll be publishing, okay? Let's do it! Okay, first we need to head our SSL module using a 2 en mod SSL command. After we do that, we need to restart our service in order to get the SSL module to start working. And let me put the status command to check if everything is okay. So, let's start by entering slash etc slash apache2 slash sites minus available folder check what we have we've got already here and let's make a copy of the default SSL virtual host to a new one that I will be calling my server dot local okay so my server dot local will be my FQDN for this experiment let me open on nano and start editing the file uh, I have activated line numbers so I can guide you a little bit better. So here on line 4 I'll be heading server name directive with my FQDN, my domain name, my server.local. Okay, so st scrolling down, uh, first I need to put the new document root. Let's go up a little bit on line 6 and change the document root folder to a new one I will create my server dot local okay so now let me take care of the SSL certificate and key file I have commented the old lines and create new ones so the SSL certificate file directive will be located on slash etc slash apache2 slash ssl slash my server dot local dot crt this will be the certificate and the next one's ssl certificate key file will be located in it slash etc slash apache2 slash ssl slash my server dot local dot key and this will be the key file so in this file we are done we have completed the configuration. Let's save and exit and proceed. So now what we have to do. I'll enter the slash var slash www folder. See what we've got and create a new folder for this new virtual host. I will call it my server dot local. Exactly the same name has my domain name. This way I will know what I'm doing. And let's use echo commands to write a little uh, sentence, a string, that I will redirect to my index.html file. Let's make a cat to confirm that information is correct. Now let's go straight to the slash etc slash apache2 folder and create a new SSL folder to store the new certificates. I will be using OpenSSL commands with all the necessary parameters to create the certificate and the key to my new virtual host. So rec minus x509 minus notes minus days. Let's put one year, 365 days, minus new key, minus RSA with 2048 bits minus key out so this will be the path for the file the key file 
ssl slash my server dot local dot uh, sorry dot key i need to write key okay and now the output file for the certificate slash etc slash apache2 slash ssl slash my server dot local dot crt okay so let's uh, fulfill this uh, little form with country name <coughs> the state and uh, province name let's put lisbon for example city name locality also the same i will put my organization just an example name for this experiment and the same here my organization also and here i'll put my domain my fqdn my server dot local and finally some email address of the webmaster at the same domain and we already have the certificates let's enter the folder and show here they are the two files we need for our virtual host now i am enabling the new virtual host with a2 en site following the name of the configuration file i will reload apache 2 configurations with the reload action and using status i am checking if everything is okay we already have Apache 2 running again. Now let's pull here a text editor. This is the, the hosts file. Find it uh, in a Linux at slash etc slash hosts. And on a Mac OS on a, a slash private slash etc. And uh, Windows, I will put the complete uh, location on the comments. I already saved it i am making a ping so i am making the correct resolution and let's activate the firewall for port 443 in tcp protocol already done the status shows that we have the correct rule and when i press https with my local domain as you can see i have a warning security warning because this certificate is local is not um, produced by uh, a root authority like verisign or trust or any other but i can proceed because i trust my server and here we have the correct message i have um, put in my index html so we have our website online if i go back to my var www my server local I can show you again that messages are the same so this is the html uh, content we could have in this case is only a simple text okay using tcp dump we will uh, check and monitor some uh, network traffic on port 443 so we can see what happens when i press refresh and here we have it the encrypted encrypted traffic uh, going through the network entering our server through ENP0S8 Ethernet uh, interface okay so this can confirm that in fact when we ask for the web page we are working with this uh, port in this uh, interface and using SS command we can confirm that we are listening on port 443 and we are done Today we have seen how to create a virtual host on Apache 2 with SSL and a fully qualified domain name. Please comment for any suggestions or doubts and subscribe my channel and click on the bell button to get notifications about new videos I will be publishing. Ok? Guys, thank you. Bye bye.